hello guys welcome back to my channel it's a girl i am cleopatra o and i'm back here with another video so um from the title of this video you guys already i've already seen that i spent 100 years on like hygiene products feminine feminine hygiene uh products and i just thought i should come here and show you these uh products that i bought so if you're interested in watching or knowing what products i bought then i think you should continue watching this video Guys, um, some of the products that I bought were actually inspired by Isimeme Edeko's video and Aisha Sek, I think, uh, which are some YouTubers here. And they did like their shower routine and everything. And to be honest, I wanted to try new products, products that could like enhance fragrance and all of that, you know. So I just took note of some things. Obviously, most of their they are bought like in the US, so most of their products were like really, really hard to find. Uh, but thank God for Douglas, really thank God for Douglas because I didn't even know that they actually have most of the American product, although they might be a bit expensive obviously compared to the normal, you know, European brands, but I mean, why not? Why not give it a try, right? And at that time when I ordered this, Douglas was actually having sales, so it was just like the perfect time. I was just like, you know what? Let's just give it. But there were some products I could, I could, I didn't find in Douglas that I actually found at the drugstore. So yeah, at the drugstore, I spent, um, I spent, let's say, thirteen euro basically. So what I got at the drugstore. I got this uh, perfume deodorant with zero aluminium. I hope you guys can see, but with zero aluminium. This actually, I was uh, recommended by a friend. Um, she had it, she had this one at home actually, and I felt like that it smelled great and it's pink blossom. And then uh, she also told me to try this. So I just decided to buy both of them since I already knew um, the smell of this and then i bought this venus tropical gillette that apparently the handle smells like yeah it's, it's written scented handle i don't know if you guys can see it's not focusing okay anyways it has scented uh, handle and it basically just smells like tropical and then it, the Oh my god, what's, it, what's this called in English? The lame, the blades. Yeah, the blades are like coated on, like coated with aloe vera gel or something like that. So I felt like it was really interesting, and I just wanted to give it a try. And and then the big package. So actually, I spent a bit more than hundred euros because this was about ninety-seven euros, I think. And then I spent 13 euros, but yeah, roughly 100 euros. And I obviously, I forgot, I also bought this. You guys know that this is my go to go moisturizer. Focus, yes. Um, this is my go to go moisturizer from Nature Drainer Oil Free. So I also got that. But let's open this now. So I said Douglas was having sales. Ah, oh, the package sm smells so good. And then it just comes like this when I open this. I got this perfume, guys. Uh, this is uh, Yves Saint Laurent Libre uh, Eau de Parfum Intense. So I was actually, I actually didn't know what perfume I wanted to take because I have been using the Chanel Mademoiselle Intense. So I really wanted to get that, but at the same time I felt like I wanted, I wanted a change. And I googled um, for longevity, the best was obviously the Chanel Mademoiselle and this one. But I just wanted a change, and I felt like this was actually nice. So I got this in 50 ml, and this was about 60 something euros. To be honest, when I saw the bottle, like I love the bottle. Bottle is so cute. I'm not even gonna lie. 
<laughs> Let me not come and break the bottle even before I start using it. But yeah, the bottle is so cute. Sorry guys, I'm my light. Yeah, the bottle is really, really, really cute. And the funniest thing is that the same day I purchased this, for some reason, everyone on my snap was actually posting about this perfume. And then I was just asking randomly if it was nice. And everyone was like, yeah, that's very nice. That's a go-to go and all of that. So I was like, why not? Why not, guys? Then um, I got this Dove. This Dove, uh, which is a, f um, how do you say, a foam shower foam foam gel but basically it's basically like in in the foam format so you can even see it from you see here that it's not the same as a normal spray or anything so it's like the consistency is basically foaming and apparently it's also good for shaving and i think it was in simeme she basically showed that she used to use that like she basically used this as a two-in-one so she takes a shower with it and then she also uses it to to shave so i've actually not never shaved with shaving sticks i've always been using wheat like the normal cream so i felt like you know what maybe i just want to give it a try and then she also spoke about the fact that it actually has a very nice fragrance well, this is actually nice. Wait, I'm just gonna. Oh wow. Oh, this actually smells good. Like, it smells so like fresh. This is actually with rose rose oil. And then I also heard people talking about the Dr. Burner uh, 18 in 1, which is this. Please, if you've used any of these products, please do let me know and let me know if you liked it. So everyone, I mean, a lot of people have been speaking about this Dr. Brunner and the fact that it's 18 in 1. I literally went to read about it and you could, <laughs> you could, use, you could use it to clean the floor, to bath, to, to wash your clothes, to brush your teeth, to wash dogs, like pets actually. Like a lot of things so basically that's why it's called 18 in one it can literally do 18 things and it was wow and it actually comes in like different easy flavors i'll call them uh so this is the peppermint and i actually chose the peppermint because i i have this i see bacne we call it like this small rashes or back or acne on my on my back and apparently a lot of people have testified that this had helped a lot um because it basically like gets rid of all germs and everything compared to like the normal shower gels. So it's a bit like more like of a medicated soap, if I'll say something like that. So yeah, to be honest, like the price that you pay for, like this is mostly like used in the USA. And I remember that this was much more cheaper on the link I saw from ECMME and uh, Aisha, but I felt like, you know what, it's actually cheaper for me to buy it from Douglas than getting shipped down here and then have to pay customs, right? So, and then now I'm so disappointed of seeing this. <laughs> Guys, I paid 20 euros for this. And the thing is that I tried it at the store and it was much bigger. Wow. I'm kind of disappointed now. Like, listen, what, this will literally last me for what? Two weeks? <laughs> but yeah, this is the Sol, Sol de Janeiro Brazilian Bum Bum Cream. So this Bum Bum Cream, I feel like a lot, I don't know if it's now i'm just hearing about it so let me know if you know about this brazilian bum bum cream but i've been hearing a lot of good things about this and i decided to give it a try because apparently it kind of tightens the skin gives you this glow according to them it gives you the brazilian glow and all of that and the smell guys so what i did when i went to douglas to try it was that I actually took a bit and then just laid it on my hands and what happened was that guys like 
for like half of the day that was just there like the smell the fragrance was just there all the time when you open it that's what it looks like can you guys see that's everything i bought actually and all of this was just as i said just a little above 100 and 100 euros so yeah so the plan is basically to just like start with the cons with the concerns areas um with this and then obviously go in with this then go in with the cream <clears throat> have my deal and then go in my perfume and there's actually this body spray um that i want to get from boots like if you're in the uk I'm, i think i'm gonna put a picture here if you've ever tried that body fingers it's actually just like 75 uh how is it called 0 0.75 so it's penny i guess and it was actually very good i'm not even gonna lie it's actually very good i've had it before and when it got it got finished i was just like why can't they just have boots all over europe but anyways that's a story for another day but that's also what something i want to get so just basically trying to layer 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 different fragrances to smell good all day all along but yeah guys i've come to the end of this video i just wanted to share this with you guys and please 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 do let me know if there's any of this products that you've used how did it help you if you didn't like it why what happened and do let me know maybe i might come back and say um and give feedback when i've tried them but when it concerns fragrance and smell and everything i've said my own everything here smells amazing i just can't wait to start using them tomorrow and yeah i hope you enjoyed this video i still remain your girl i am cleopatra O. and if you have not subscribed to my channel please 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 do subscribe to my channel as it encourages me to give you more content and also please what do you want to see on my channel i'm here for you so drop suggestion you can text me uh anywhere and please follow me on my socials i'll definitely follow you back and dm me with anything that you want to see and i will definitely appreciate it but thank you so much guys kisses bye